Hi, welcome guys. I'm Sifu Wong from Seed Wing Chun Combat System. Welcome to our series of instructional video using 360. Now let me just introduce my team. Together with me, if you pan to your right now, you will see Kenneth on your right. Hi, I'm Kenneth. If you keep on panning to your right, you will see Bala at the back. Hello, I'm Bala. If you keep on panning to your right again, you will see Wan Lee on my right. Hi, I'm Wan Lee. Alright, again, welcome to our instructional videos of uh, 360. And uh, what we are going to do next is going to uh, bring you through the forms of uh, Siu Lin Tao on how it has been performed in detail. Alright, so enjoy and also feel free to rewind back and pause whichever you tend to miss out the details there. Enjoy! Okay guys, let's start. Okay. Put your feet together, stand straight, both hands up, grab the fist. Now as you reduce your height, pull both of these hands backwards quickly. Here we go. Point the finger down, point the finger down, and chop down, both hands together. Cross your hand, left over right. Make sure that the wrist is touching your wrist. Grab the fist, turn up, open it, hit down, pull back, all the way back to your chest. Now we are trying to open the stance by turning your toes apart and heels after that. So this will be your stance for the rest of the forms. All right, as we beginning to do the forms, the first movement of the form is going to be like this. Cross hands, left over right. Make sure that your wrist is touching the wrist. From the touching point, turn up until your fingers are reaching roughly your eyebrow area. Pull it back, both hands as a fist. Put your left hand to the center. Straighten the elbow out as a straight punch. Open up the palm. Turn your wrist in slowly and point the finger to the front as soon as you feel you can't turn anymore. Grab a fist, pull back. Same repetition with right hand, put it into the center. Push to the front, straight punch. Open up the palm, circle your wrist, and point to the front as soon as you can't turn anymore. Grab a fist and pull back. So what we have did just now are determining our center line, our side lines, and side lines. So basically, you are going to have a cross in front of you. So now, as the next movement goes, you are going to do it pretty slow. For each movement, you're supposed to be doing it in 30 seconds for each of the hands. But due to time constraint, we are going to do it slightly faster so that to avoid the delay in the video. So now, first movement, consider this. Left hand, palms open up. Sink down the shoulder slightly a little. Use the elbow to push out the hands. Until the finger touches the center line that you have determined, just now stop there. And use this center line as a guidance. Keep on pushing to the front. And as soon as you feel that your elbow is leaving your body, try to pull the elbow in to your center as much as possible. Then push it to the front. Until it ranges about like 3 inch distance, roughly 3 inch distance from the body, then you stop. Don't go overly too straight, don't overextend it. Then this is your first hand, we call it the spreading hands or Tan Sao. Circle your hands in. This is what we call the circling hand or Hin Sao. Until you can't turn anymore. Bring the fingers up. This is your second hand, we call it the Wu Sao. And detail for Wu Sao is whereby your fingers are pointing up straight. So if you can't see it, hand to your left or either your right, you can see the fingers there are pointing up straight. Now bring back this hand by retracting your elbow back to you. Now keep on maintaining the center of your lines along your fingers. Bring it in, bring it in until you reach about like 3 inch distance from your face, then you stop. 3 inch distance from your face, then you stop. Then release the wrist down now. Just relax it. Now make sure that your wrist, it falls under your center. Do not go across to the left or even to the right or anywhere else. It has to be in the center. Now your hands will be, and the hands and fingers are totally relaxed. 
Now use the elbow again to push the wrist out along the center line and this is what we call the Fox out. And what you are going to do in this Fox out, you are going to repeat about three times of this Fox out. And again the same thing, as you feel the elbow is leaving the body, try to pull it as close as possible to the center as much as you can. Then about three inch distance from your body, then you stop and you continue it with a circling hand. Bring it up. Second time of this Fox out, bring it back. Bring it back. 3 inch distance, then you stop, release it, release it, focus out for the second time, push it up, bring it into the center, the elbow, stop, circling up, and bring it back. 3 inch distance, you stop, then you release it, make sure that your wrists are still at the center line. So make sure that your wrist stays at the center line as long as you push it up on the same line. So bring the elbow in. This is the third time of our repetition of this Fox out. Circle up your hand. Fox out. Bring it back. So now once you have done for three times of that repetition, we are going to end this Fox out with the slapping hand or Pax out to your right. Make sure that this Pax out doesn't exceed your shoulder distance. Okay, Don't go overly stretched. Then bring it back to the center. Try to face your palm to your front. Then use the elbow to do a palm strike to your face area. Now you should be blocking your view in front of you, which is correct. Now open up the palm, circling the wrist. Now remember when you try to circle the wrist, the elbow do not bend. Make sure that your elbows are straight at all times. Until you can't circle, point the finger to the front, grab a face and pull it back. Now repeat the same repetition with the right hand. We are going to do this fast. Right hand, palms open up, shoulder down, push it to the front. This is the first pan sao, bring center. Fin sao, bring it up. Wu sao, bring it back. Remember all this hand, you're supposed to do it in 30 seconds before you reach the destination. For the video purpose, we are going to do it slightly faster. Release the wrist, hook sao number one, push it up. Bring it to center. Queen Sao, bring it up. Wu Sao, bring it in. Release the wrist. Push it up. Focus out for the second time. Circle up. Wu Sao, bring it in. Release it. Focus out for the third time. Circle up. Wu Sao, bring it back. And since you've done the third time of your Fox out, we are going to end it with the Pax out to your left shoulder this time. So now make sure that this Pax out is a straight line. Don't slap to the back or even up or anywhere else. It's just a straight line to your shoulder area. Bring it back to the center. Palm face in front. Use the elbow to do a palm strike straight. Open up the palm. Circling the wrist. Point to the front. Grab a fist and back. So that was the first sections of our Sudim Town. So feel free to rewind back and pause and to see what are the details that we might have missed out along the process.